In the 1970s, the growth of northeastern Berks County had gotten to the point where plans for the 222 bypass began in earnest. It also became clear the bypass would cut through part of Kutztown University's property. After studying topographical maps and comparing them to the plans for the bypass, Dr. Ron Ryan found a small stream running through the property and knowing the potential for the land, began lobbying for KU to keep the parcel. And I saw there was an intermittent stream on, I could see the relief for the hill, and I thought, wow, the university has a potential site for preservation. Located northwest of campus off Sheridan Road, the 40-acre eco-plot has served the university as a living laboratory, a landscape that functions as an outdoor scientific study hall, a biological system to bring the classroom to this natural environment. In 1991, I became department chair and remained so in that position for about 16 years. And at that time, Dr. Don Mellinger, who's a professor emeritus, uh, took over the environmental science program to coordinate it and then took over the responsibility for this. Now I have to tell you something. He decided that this place needed a much more concise name. So Dr. Mellinger called this the eco plot. And thereafter it became known as the eco plot. And so now I have to tell you the Ronald R. Ryan Environmental <laughs> Study Area is AKA the eco plot. So today we dedicate the eco plot in Dr. Ryan's name in appreciation of his commitment to the continued success of Kutztown University, Kutztown University students, and to the study of the environment, ecology, and the biological sciences. I have to tell you something. Of all of the accolades I have received over the years, uh, and, and I've appreciated all of them, this one was the closest to my heart. <laughs> well, this wonderful property now is, is used for teaching and for undergraduate research. And what I, one thing we must also remember in addition to that, it's, it's, a, it's a dedication that Kutztown University has made to open space preservation. And open space preservation is crucial in southeastern Pennsylvania <clears throat> because we have a lot of development in southeastern Pennsylvania, some of it good and lots of it not so good. And this kind of area is, demonstrates Kutztown's commitment to, uh, to preserving open, open space, and I appreciate that.